I was destined to be in Texas. I'll never forget the smell of that Texas air the first time I landed at DFW and said, this is the place. I grew up in Salt Lake City, Utah, and SMU was this place I heard about my whole life because my mother had gone to SMU, her mother had gone to SMU. We had this community around SMU that almost felt very aspirational to go and be part of this really exciting place. While I was at SMU, I was always trying to start a business or be inventive to some degree. And so there was this entrepreneurial spirit about me at a younger age that in hindsight, I think was unique. After college, I took a very untraditional route and I decided to go travel Southeast Asia for a few months and really start to see the world. And while I was there, I had this real, um, desire to find a way to connect people when they travel. And so my wheels already started turning about how could we leverage the cell phone and technology to help people connect with people around them and find people they didn't know yet. Meanwhile, I return back to the United States and I end up taking a job interview at a tech incubator. And one of the projects we launch out of this incubator ends up being Tinder. Being a co-founder of what became one of the most interesting and fast-growing startups, it was obviously incredibly devastating when I left because I was saying goodbye to everything that I had worked so hard for. I am a firm believer that problems and painful moments are opportunities. The Tinder departure was a growth experience for Whitney, but it was really an opportunity to grow, redefine herself. That experience actually was a launching pad for Bumble. The original idea was I wanted to start a women-only social network where compliments were the currency. Bumble started as a dating app where women make the first move to put women in control of their dating experience. It has since evolved into a friend-finding product and into a community product and also a broader brand that advocates for what we believe is pushing relationships in the better direction. Whitney is just a true inspiration. She has built an amazing brand. She's a marketing genius, plain and simple. All those spin on words and amazing ads you see, that's Whitney. Bumble is now a very global business. We have offices in multiple cities around the world, really anywhere across planet Earth at this point, there could very well be a Bumble love story or a Bumble baby. And I think that's what really makes us the most proud is the scale and the impact that we can have on people's lives. Going public was very exciting because it meant we could share our story with anybody who believed in it. It was really surreal to be navigating first-time motherhood while leading up to taking a company public. It was definitely the most challenging time of my life, but also the most rewarding. We at Bumble Inc. really strive to create kind connections, and that means internally as well. Kindness is honest, kindness is respectful, kindness is about doing the right thing, even if it's the hard thing. We have a program at Bumble called Moves Making Impact, where every time a woman makes the first move, she can actually select who she wants to benefit through that move. So every time she sends the first message, a portion of that will go to a cause of her choice. One of the biggest benefits to having this success for Whitney was the ability to give back. How can I help women? How can I help children? In 2019, we were able to pass a law that would make the sending of an unsolicited lewd image illegal in the state of Texas. It was shocking to me to see the disparity between what is okay on the internet, but what is not okay offline. We want to take a leading role in making the internet safer and more accountable for everyone. Two years ago, she started started her own foundation where she really wants to create a major impact. When it comes to causes that we 
Brittany engages in, she sees the needs of society with her heart and addresses those needs with her curiosity, courage, and passion. Whitney is just an inspiration. The brand that she has built from the ground up and turned it into a public company, all while giving back to the community, and it's just remarkable. This is just the beginning uh, for her, and get ready, because it, she will really move the needle in a lot of different ways for uh, our world today.